Hello, I'm going to show you how insanely quick Merch Wizard is for creating multiple uploads, how it can resize for the hoodie and pop socket size PNGs on the fly as well. I'm not going to show you how to set up the Airtable. I did find this very difficult and in fact it didn't even upload my PNGs. But I found that that doesn't really matter because you can always update to Airtable on any specific products that you're interested in. So the best way to use Merch Wizard is to select previous designs and use them as a base for your new uploads. As when you're on the higher tiers, you're usually making t-shirts in the same niches that you've made before. So you can reuse all your text I'll show you what I mean. So here's one that I want to sort of replicate and I've searched for it here. And what you can do is go here and and search for it on your Airtable. And if you can't find it on the Airtable, you just update to Airtable there. So we found it, we'll select it. And there is the PNG, which we can download if we want. But uh, that's all the information we want. So if we go to multiple uploads and let's just do everything, I'm doing a new one. And if we scroll down to the product details and then click on the Merch Wizard icon again, it will then populate all of these text fields with all the text from your chosen shirt. So I know I can only have to go into a few things here and change a few words. Now, very important when you're doing this with the new multi uploader to not mention the fact that it's a t-shirt or a long sleeve because we're using the same text for all of these different products so we're just doing very general text in the product features so when i'm happy that this text is fine for this product and it doesn't mention any of the product names such as t-shirt long sleeve although i have the word shirts in the brand i think that's okay then I can just copy that text in English, go into the German section, paste the text and translate it to German. Sometimes you get an issue with too many characters in the product features, but this time we're okay. So all we have to do now is to upload the PNG. Now, while that's uploading, we should select the colors and, and maybe put the price down for the T-shirt but I will use the default price on all the other products. It's good to start with this standard t-shirt and choose as many colors as you can and then copy the colors as that will help you with the other products where you can paste those colors and you don't have too many to click after that. So I'll leave the premium t-shirt price as the default and I'll leave most of them as the default now. Just add all those colors. I'm finding light orange design go well these days because they go with just about every color you can imagine. Now another thing you should do while you're doing this is activate the resizer. Now this is real benefit of Merch Wizard that we can create the hoodie PNG. So I'm just going to reduce the design to go into the, that square, move it up a bit. There's our hoodie PNG and then we select the pop socket. The pop socket has a default background of black, which I use 99% of the time. And make sure that's centered. Make sure there's a bit of space around there because remember the edges can be folded around the pop socket. So you, you don't want your design to go right up to the edge of that circle. So let's download the pop socket PNG, but we're back to the editing colors. We still haven't finished, still got to do the long sleeve and raglan. I like doing the orange designs because they go in all the raglans. We have to upload the hoodie PNG. It's in my downloads folder. And whilst that is uploading, we can upload the pop socket PNG that we just downloaded. And now the last thing we have to do is choose the colors for the hoodies. And as for the pop socket, we don't have to bother. And that is it. All we have to do now is review and now all of these products, not just for the .com, for the UK and German site, these are all going to be submitted now. So I hope that helps. That's how to 
submit multiple products using Merch Wizards, which will speed up your ability to write the text and choose all the colors. Hope that was useful. My name's Rob from robcummon.com. I'll see you in another video.